Preheated it and I put some tortillas and some foil. And then I'm going to put it in the oven. Just for about 10 minutes. Uh, maybe not so long, but just so the tortillas cook. Uh, I'm just going to check on my kids for two seconds and I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, so I just got a pepper in my eye. I don't know how. I guess, oh, look at that, that burn. Okay, so I'm back. You know what? I didn't do this before, but... I think I'm gonna put a like a few garlic cloves in my uh, pepper mix just because I love garlic <laughs> and I use garlic all the time and it just always tastes that much better when added so I'm just gonna put some garlic. This chicken is looking really good. So the baby food is ready and I'm gonna show you what it looks like once it's soft. Um, where is the... I'm just adding a little bit of garlic in the, with the peppers just to give it a little bit more flavor. That chicken is looking good. Oh, I wish you could smell this. It smells amazing. Okay, so here is what the chicken looks like as it's cooking. Look at that chicken. I'm just gonna have, I'm just gonna cook it a little bit more. And then over here for the fajita so for those of you that are just uh joined i'm making chicken fajitas tonight for my family with a super easy recipe and this is the baby cook that i'm using to make cassie um, some baby food. My daughter's five months, almost. Well, she'll be five months next week. And so I'm, I make her baby food. Where's the little, 
the thing. Okay, I need to find. There's supposed to be like a little thingy. I'm just gonna take out. This is, you need to be careful when you do this, but like with the baby cook, cook it gets really hot. So on the sides, here's the steamed carrots and sweet potatoes. And here's the extra water at the bottom. Um, and it's like carrot and sweet potato water now. And I usually, I just pour that water into like a cup, just like that. And then I'll put, I put the steam carefully put the carrots and the sweet potatoes back in. Ooh, don't wanna burn myself. Just like that. You see, so it's all steamed. And then sometimes I'll just take out what doesn't look good. So this piece doesn't really look good and I don't want to feed that to my baby. Um, that piece doesn't look good. And I just, I literally just went to Whole Foods yesterday and bought all of this, these vegetables and, but I'm really funny with things that I feel like it doesn't really look like it should be in there. I'll just take it out. So then I'll put the, oh, that doesn't look good. Then I'll add the water back into, just like that. Close it. Oh, I don't know. Hold on. I have to put this down. Hold on one second. Oh, wait. I know why it's not closing. I need. There's another piece. another piece that goes with this baby cook that I don't know where oh okay here it is found it so I'll just I just put the lid on the vegetables close it I'm not having a problem with it. Of course, when I'm live, it doesn't want to close for me. Maybe if I hold it and just, you know, it has to close. There we go. There we go. It closed. Okay. So you just blend it just like this. y'all can hear me but sometimes I even put a little bit of applesauce in her um, baby uh, vegetable puree just to make it a little bit you know a better give it a better taste for Cassie because Cassie really likes applesauce so I just put a little bit in the vegetable and mix it up so she will be willing to eat it So this is what it's going to look like. This is your baby food. This is carrots and sweet potatoes. You're just going to mix it up with this little thing that it comes with. And here you have some baby food. Cassie loves, well she don't really love it just yet, but I mean, I feel like she's getting the hang of eating <laughs> just a little bit. She doesn't eat much of it, so I just freeze it, and then when, because it's so much baby food, there's, you know, so I freeze it, and then when she's ready to eat, I just take out little cubes. It's super cute. Let me show you, actually. So 
there's like these little things you can buy um, that Bayaba make, which is um, who makes this baby cup. And you just fill each little, you fill it with the food and you just freeze it. And then when you're ready to serve the, your baby, you just, you just pull it out, just like push it out just like that. And it pops out into a cup and then you steam it. And then there you have your baby food. So you don't waste all of this that I made. I just made it today. She really doesn't eat anymore, but I made it today just to show you how I make baby food for Cassie. All right, so I'm gonna let this cool down because this is Cass, Cassie's food for tonight. Some fresh baby food. And we're gonna go back over here. Um, I always like to make sure after I cook that everything is plated really pretty so he, so my family gets excited to eat. <laughs> so in a second we're going to just plate um, the food. Oh, it's getting a little messy here. So my mother-in-law bought me these, uh, they're called uh, bazooki skillets, and uh, that's one of my husband's favorite desserts. And so tonight, I'm going to use them to serve Sterling these chicken fajitas. I think they're great, and it'll be the first time I use them, but I think they're kind of nice to just serve with, so... Thank you to my mother-in-law, Sherry Shepard, for buying me these amazing pan um, skillets. I'm just going to cook the chicken just a little bit longer just to make sure that it cooks all the way through. And sometimes like with chicken, just to be just because I'm crazy with the chicken and just to make sure that it's cooked all the way through. I'll, I'll put the skillet actually in my oven just for like about four minutes just to make sure that the chicken is cooked all the way. take out the tortillas out of the oven which we put in a while ago This is how the chicken is looking over here. That chicken looks nice. So just for a few minutes, I'm just going to put this skillet. Oh, I can't hold it in here. But I'm going to put this skillet just right in the oven. Just so that I know that is cooked all the way through just for a few like maybe four minutes
So in a minute, I'm going to show you what it all looks like after it's all done. Alright, so I'm going to call Sterling in here in a second after everything is plated and have him try everything and he'll tell you what he thinks of my chicken fajitas tonight. Hopefully we can get him to go on my live feed. Um, I got to check on the baby. Give me two seconds. Okay, sorry about that guys. I'm back. Okay, let me just open it. Let me make sure. So I just opened a little, okay, this is cooked well, so. You know what, this is gonna be So I'm gonna drop a piece of chicken. The stove is off now. Put the chicken right here so you can see it. My mom's here with us. She's taking care of the kids. Cassie's really sleepy. You can hear her in the background. I'm just trying to prepare the meal for everybody. So. Okay, so this is the chicken right here. I'm gonna do one at a time and just cut it in little slices so you can see. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna cut the, the chicken into little, oh. I'm trying to figure out how to cut this so y'all can see what I'm doing. So I have the chicken right here. So I'm going to cut it. Keep it together so it looks pretty. So then once you cut up one piece of chicken, you can put it on this little skillet here and then serve it. I guess you put it on the, the stove for a second so it gets hot and then it, you know what? I won't even do it like that because I really don't know how to do it. My mom just suggested that I do it for y'all like that. But really, I don't know how to, to serve it like that. I just know how to serve it how I serve it. So this is what y'all going to get today. <laughs> That's what my family is going to get. 
All right, so I'm just gonna put the chicken on the, the white plate after it's all cut. Callie's in the living room watching Trolls World Tour. I don't know how many times she's watched this movie, but she loves it. My kids, they live on Disney Plus. It's really bad. I try to do other things, like go for walks and read her books. And, you know, she loves her movie, though. She can sit there literally all day and watch movies so i have to get her from off the couch and actually do stuff I cut really slow, sorry. So I cut up all the chicken. I'm gonna put all this chicken on this plate. Okay, so y'all ready to see what it looks like? All right, so here's our chicken fajitas for the night. Some chicken, um, peppers, tortillas, chips, avocado. Oh, I didn't get the avocado. Sour cream. All right, so I'm gonna just um, cut some avocado. And this is the baby food for Cassie. Somebody said my fajitas were uh, a fajita, so maybe I should just cut them down just a little bit. Oh, uh, here comes Sterling. He's gonna taste the, the food that I made, everybody.
Done? Yeah. How's it look? Can look you? Good. I'm live. Would you taste it for everybody and tell them how good it is? <laughs> so I'm just gonna get this avocado. I'm good on the avocado for real, for real. Calvin Clay. Come here. Callie. Callie. She watching them trolls. Callie, food's ready, baby. I'm just Which scooping out the avocado. Her? Huh? What you want me to give her? Well. Chicken? Yeah, you can give her peppers too. Oh, you sorry, can make baby. it. Here. You know what I'm going to do for her? Uh -oh. um, <laughs> warm up the cheese because she likes her cheese warm. You see the cheese? You love cheese. You see the cheese? Whoa. 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 <laughs> you hear Cass Callie? She gets excited Jeez. when she sees something she wants Jeez. to eat. So she's just like What you want, chicken? She yeah. likes avocados too. Which which one you want? Yeah. You want that, you want uh, that, you want all that, huh? I needed a plate, babe. Put my avocados on. Here, daddy will make yours first. Come on. Did Cassie fall asleep? No. She's still awake? I heard her crying in a second ago. She ain't sleep. Hey, big baby. Are you still online? Mm-hmm. Give me a girl's phone. I wanted you to try it for everybody so you can... They want me to go, you guys. Um, hey, Grammy. You're still online. She, uh, your mom joined me when I first started. She's still on. Oh, bless you. <laughs> oh, don't you sneeze, sneeze on, the food, on the food, Callie. It's okay. Okay. <laughs> I made all this good food and Callie going to sneeze on it. So, <laughs> come here, babe. Can you show them your plate? Everybody just wants to say hi. I don't want to see my paper plate. <laughs> Certainly got a paper plate. He was supposed to put on a nice plate so that he could show you his chicken fajita. I don't want to have to do too many dishes after I get done. So this is what it looks like. Um, here, Callie, say hi. Say hi, Callie. Say hi. You're not going to say hi? Here, she wants cheese. Okay, can you taste it and tell everybody how it tastes and how, you know, I put so much work, they just eat. They don't care. They just like, ah, whatever, Mom. Oh, my God. They do that on the camera. <laughs> my God. Right. Make me want to say how do. <laughs> Come yeah. here. Taco sauce. See? Mm, That's what great. makes me it's happy. You like it? Mm-hmm. When your family likes it, it's worth all the time and effort you put into making it. Where's taco sauce at? Um, is it really, really that good? Yeah. Where's the taco sauce? Um, it should be right there. Let me get it for you. It's not in the um, refrigerator, I don't think. Okay, Kelly, let's make your, let's make your plate. Want cheese? You want cheese? I know you want cheese. I know you like cheese. Okay, Grammy's back on. Now she's on. You want to say hi? Say hi to mom. your mom. Say hi, Grammy. Say hi. <laughs> she is uh -oh. not having... Oh, Dad. What happened? Uh-oh, yeah, yeah. We'll get it in a second. You want cheese? You like cheese, huh? You want cheese? Mm hmm? Hmm? You like chicken, too. Chicken and cheese. You want it all. Say chicken, chicken, I'm making chicken. 
Uh, do I, put, I see do I you, put Heidi. This in the... I see you, Natalie. I see you, Grammy. We love you. We wish you were here. Chanel, you want to put this in the wrap for her? Yeah, and just put some cheese on there and melt it down. Mm. Here. You nibble Who on Who else that. is online? Yep, I got you, I got you, I got you on the cheese. I ain't forget. All right, I'm gonna show you guys my chicken fajitas because now I see I got more people online looking at this than I had before, so. <laughs> uh, she don't need none of the uh, peppers. Peppers, let me get that. Yeah, she might like it, I mean. You want peppers? You don't know. Mm. Okay. I see. I see. I know you. That's all you seem to want is the cheese. I see. I see. <laughs> Callie. Callie. Say hi. <laughs> okay, so here's the chicken and the peppers and the tortillas. This right here, this is for Cassie. This is her baby food. Here's some cheese and some sour cream. And I just cut up some avocados. So, um, so I'm going, I'm going to just check on the baby real quick. And as soon as I get back, I will share with you the recipe. So you know exactly how to make it. And I'll walk you through it just one last time. And then I'm going to eat with my family. So give me a All right, I'm back. So tonight I made um, chicken fajitas. And I marinated my chicken first for 30 minutes. Uh, and I used five ingredients to marinate it. I used ground cumin, some um, red pepper, crushed red pepper, oil, lime and garlic i um let it marinate. i let it marinate and then after I, I mean i marinated it this morning so it's been in there in the refrigerator pretty much all day which is perfect and then um Here, i um put Here. oil a little bit of oil on my skillet then put the chicken on there let it cook cooked my um peppers seasoned it cut up all the all the things that my family likes to have in their fajitas some avocados um i put some of the tortillas in the oven and soy sauce i mean not soy sauce i'm sorry sour cream mm -hmm. cheese and a little bit of this taco sauce and I'll get some of those on what do you want Avocado. Um, this is for Callie. Yeah. Mm. And that's it. Yeah, that's it. Um, I learned a lot of uh, the recipes that I have from this website. It's called um, Cafe Delight. And a girlfriend of mine shared it with me, and ever since it's just been super cheese? easy just to make Here. quick meals in the kitchen. So you hopefully, you know, you enjoyed your time with me. This was fun. Mm. I'm enjoy the rest of my red wine.